Welcome to Dateline Schools, a presentation of the St. Clair County Regional Educational Service Agency with your host, Terry Harrington. All this week on Dateline Schools, we're learning about a new imagination library that's being created here in St. Clair County as part of a partnership between the United Way of St. Clair County and St. Clair County RESA. And to tell us all about it, my special guests are Lonnie Stevens from the United Way of St. Clair County, as well as the Great Start Collaborative Director here at RESA, Riley Alley. And, and Riley, why is it so important to really start emphasizing and working with these kids from birth until they start school? Uh, well, children, the brain is developed mostly before the children even enter school. So we know that um, from zero to five is a really an important time to work on um, a lot of different developmental skills. This program in particular is really looking at literacy. Um, it promotes having the book mailed right to the child, promotes that excitement about literacy, but it also promotes the parent-child positive interactions, making sure that the parent is looking and excited with the child and reading that book. Um, the studies have, and research has shown that this program um, does increase those positive parent and child interactions. It increases the literacy activities in the home, um, and it also increases the school readiness when the child enters kindergarten. Is there a component, too, for the parents or more of an encouragement to, for them to look at what the children have and, and to read with them and just work through them? Um, with the with the child receiving the book mailed directly to them, that gets the excitement. They are going to um, look to the parent to read it to them. So there's really more of an encouragement for parents to be active and involved in their child's life. Um, there's not a requirement, but we really like to reach out there to parents and teach them what the importance of this program is. And Lonnie, from where you sit in the community and the people you work with, I imagine uh, from your perspective, this is really a real key to even helping to solve some other issues, not just educationally here in our county too, isn't it? Very much so. If we can get parents and children interacting more, working together more, and when you asked Riley about how we're going to put that component in, I think this show is an excellent example of that. If every time we talk, we talk about that, we'll be able to get that message to the parents. And the reason that's becoming more important is, as Riley pointed out, this research that we've done on brain development is relatively new. So for all of us that went to school at a different time and entered kindergarten with a different kind of expectation, um, we need to train these parents and teach them that the new research says you need to do a little bit more. So we need the media to get to them, and we'll be doing some things around that. And with 10,000 kids in that zero to five range here in St. Clair County, that could be a big impact. That certainly could be. And think of the good it can do on down the line. If they start being involved in understanding those things when children are very small, then as they go into school, it isn't just about reading readiness. It's about parent readiness to be at the parent-teacher conference, parent readiness to be involved in the schools. We'll be back with more tomorrow. For Dayline Schools, I'm Terry Harrington.